Subscribe to our channel, press the bell icon and never miss an update from Latestly. There will be further warming in the coming decades. What is clear from this report is that unless there are immediate, strong, rapid and large-scale reductions in greenhouse gas emissions, limiting global warming to 1.5 degrees Celsius will be beyond reach. The report shows that in the next 20 years, global warming the average temperature at the Earth's surface over a period of 20 years is expected to reach or exceed 1.5 degrees Celsius above the late 1800s. However, if we rapidly reduce greenhouse gas emissions, if we can reach global net zero CO2 emissions around 2050, it is extremely likely that we can keep global warming well below 2 degrees. If we do this, it is more likely than not that temperature would gradually decline to below or around 1.5 degrees Celsius by the end of the century with a temporary overshoot of no more than 0.1 degrees Celsius. But if global greenhouse gas emissions remain around today's levels in the coming decades, we would reach 2 degrees of global warming by the middle of this century. With every additional amount of global warming, we will see greater changes in the climate. Every additional half degree of warming will cause increases in the intensity and frequency of hot extremes, heavy precipitation and drought. At two degrees of global warming, heat extremes would more often reach critical tolerance thresholds for agriculture and human health. At a global scale, extreme daily rainfall events intensify by about 7% for each additional degree Celsius of global warming. As you see, future further changes depend on future human influence.